Hello, my name is Dr. Michael Brownstein. Some of you may already know me. I've been a plastic surgeon for the last 37 years, and for the last 35 years, I've concentrated my practice on trans surgery, specifically top surgery for me, female to male patients and for uh, gender non-conforming patients. After 35 years of doing this, I've made a big decision. I've decided to retire at the end of this year. It's been a difficult decision, but one that I think is important for me. And at the same time, it's important to me that the practice continue. I want it to continue and I want to continue to serve the trans community. In trying to perpetuate this practice, I knew it would be necessary and desirable to find a competent surgeon to take over my practice. And I've been able to do that. I found Dr. Curtis Crane. Dr. Crane is a personable guy who is very well trained in trans surgeries. He will be a capable top surgeon and also a gender confirmation genital surgeon. So I'd like to take this opportunity to introduce you to Dr. Curtis Crane. Thank you, Dr. Brownstein. Your reputation precedes you and it's an honor to be here. Very early in my training, I knew I wanted to serve the trans community. So I was able to tailor my 10 years of residency in reconstructive urology and plastic surgery towards meeting this goal. I worked multiple times in Belgrade, Serbia with Miroslav Georgievic, traveled to Bangkok, Thailand to work with Dr. Precha and his team, and also completed a fellowship in Ghent, Belgium with Dr. Monstre. I've worked with trans patients from all over the world and am very excited to be in San Francisco and share what I've learned from my travels around the world seeing other surgeons operate. I'm glad you've had the opportunity to meet Dr. Crane. I'm so pleased that my practice will be left in good hands. Dr. Crane will be starting at January 1st, 2013, and the name of the practice will be Brownstein Crane Surgical Services. I'll be staying through January 2013 to teach Dr. Crane my specific techniques for top surgery. I'd like to take this opportunity because I will be leaving the practice to thank all the patients that I've learned to know and take care of over these 35 years. I have to thank them for all that they've taught me. I really appreciate it. And I'd like to thank the people who've been my office staff over 35 years, any number of them that have gone through the office and gone on actually to nursing school. I'd like to thank my wife who's worked in the office and has supported me all these years. So thank you all, and I think that Dr. Crane will be a worthy replacement. Hope to see you.